going on everybody today we have a different video today we're going to be rating uh worst to best figures in my collection elite edition so i'm going to rate all the, a bunch of different elites from worst to first like basically the ones i like the most and then the ones i dislike strongly first we're going to start off we're going to work our way down to the best one this one i mean this one i think it's like the worst the worst in my opinion because it's just too round i i feel like this one is just like it's just so many it's just round i don't like it you can't even take the helmet off either it's just way way too round that is going to be our last place right there unfortunately he's got to take that spot but next up we have a kind of similar figure and for the same reasons but this is the one from the scarab so it gets additional points uh but this one yeah nothing too much going on i like the helmet design hopefully they make that in like a newer set he takes the second to last or second to worst actually i was gonna grab one but we're gonna be moving on to this one the only reason this one's higher up is because of that sick design but same problem too round love the colors though there he is and then this one's probably gonna surprise some people the elite zealot i I've just never liked this design. It's just kind of weird looking. I don't like it. And the orange, this is probably the best color. I could find the orange and pink. So, yeah, that guy's going to have to take it there. Next up, we have the same one right there, but in gold. The gold just makes this thing like 10 times better. And honestly, same figure, just gold. Going to be putting him over there. Uh, next up we have another figure from the scarab uh, this one's definitely way cooler because of these like i don't know tusks and thing else has these giant armor plates it's got some nice blue engraving right there moving on and this one is actually the ac or orange chase figure i just i don't know why i love the orange it looks like he's like charged up or you can act like he's getting like maybe destroyed or killed and the shields like i don't know deactivating on him this figure is awesome i love the color on that one uh moving up we have this figure this one is from the blind bags it's i just don't really like the design and the yellow yellow color i like i do like the uh the look of the armor like very wavy but yeah just not my favorite figure nothing much to talk about him and then we're coming up on this guy, the Elite Commander. The helmet is just really, really cool. I love these. The only thing I don't like is this like shoulder pad right here. It just looks way too big. And the, I don't know. I don't like how it doesn't cover like the front part of his face. And Halo 5 armor is kind of like okay, mediocre. Moving on, we have actually let's let's bring up this guy. This guy, the Jetpack Trooper definitely not one of my favorites it's definitely better than that one but you know what S switch this guy that guy's actually before this guy this guy's after him because this one actually in my opinion actually looks cooler than his or that guy so we're going to be putting him over there moving on we have the clash on the ring elite uh soldier or whatever this guy's called he's got uh this nice helmet can come off I just think the blue is way too bright and vibrant and I definitely do not care for that gold down there actually that gold actually does make it look a little bit better but yeah this guy is not gonna be first place <sighs> all right this one I I didn't wait forget this what is this guy doing here this guy's last place this guy's yellow what how do I not even see that? Oh my gosh. Okay, <laughs> moving on. This guy is absolutely awesome. I love this figure, but the only downside is when the, when you play with it, like wear it out, the legs start falling off. Not with this one, but with some. This one, I like how it has a ball joint. This flood figure is awesome in every way, almost. That's why he is not too far off to first place. All right, moving on. We've got a regular elite. This guy's so cool. He's got the yellow. He's got a sword. He's got the like shoulder pads. He's got everything. He's awesome looking, and but just not too much detail. That's why I put him lower on the on the list. 
get? Let me see here. Which ones do I got? Ah, the Elite Zealot. Uh, what am I saying now? The Elite. I forget what this guy's name is. The Elite. Ah, for uh, Zealot? Is it? No, it's not Zealot. The Zealot's the other one. The I don't. I forget. Uh, Ultra. Yeah, Elite Ultra. He's in the dark armor. The white one is definitely not as cool as this one, so that's why I picked this one. Well, Avalanche. Alright, next figure up, we have got... Here, let's see. Ah, uh, this guy. The Arbiter. The old OG Arbiter. This one is an awesome figure. This isn't the old, like, OG Arbiter. This is, like, I'm pretty sure the other one. But definitely awesome looking with the nice golden textures. Came in the Phantom. Sauron, I, I almost said Sauron's hand. <laughs> no, uh, Didax hand. Here we go. I love that blue on top, then the the hand. You know what this reminds me of? Good thing I have this here because I'm making another video. Uh, this, it looks like that. Like Sauron's hand from the Lord of the Rings minifigures. It looks like that on his chest. Does it not? Yes, it does. Complete. I don't know. That's just, just cool to me. I like that. Uh, next up is starting to get hard here. Uh, we have got the Golden Elite uh, Warlord here. The reason it's not like higher up is because there's a different Warlord that I want to place in front of this guy. He's definitely an awesome figure. Came in the, I think, Scorpion Tank Halo Infinite one. Next up in line, we have got this Warlord. The yellow just makes this one like like two times better than the yellow one i don't know what it is the yellow just makes it yellow just screams covetant to me well this one is banished so that's probably why but this one is just awesome looking and this was my ever first ever custom one that i purchased i bought like a like weathered one moving on we've got the og arbiter this one is like just awesome i love having this guy next to next to the master chief on the warthog just like, I don't know, teaming up to take down those hunters, that set was absolutely phenomenal. Love the gold here. Oh god. Just yawned. Alright. Uh the I think I glued this one. Yeah, I glued the helmet on because this one like kept coming off and it broke. And then I had to buy like some other ones, but that's why that one's like that. Here we go. Elite honor guard this guy is absolutely no not honor guard uh lights of sync helios yeah there we go this guy's absolutely awesome with the nice golden uh print not printing uh paint there next up this one it's i love this one i love the arbor the halo 5 arbiter it's probably my favorite armor for the arbiter just because of this white i mean uh red stripe and the red just the detailing. I I don't like how this one's exposed the arm, but this one definitely makes up for it. This is the uh, probably the best arbiter we're gonna get in here. Next up is the Halo Heroes original honor guard. This one is just absolutely awesome because it's like a darker color scheme here with the nice helmet and then the uh, black arms like jumpsuit with that nice black like stripes coming in there. This one's definitely on my top, on the top of my list. I'll put that guy down there. Next up, we have this guy from one of the newest blind bag series. Definitely awesome with the new, uh, I think, plasma repeater. And then we've got the nice uh, blue there. And then, yeah, the back's just plain. Next up, we have this guy. I just love this armor. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I know I said I don't like how it was round in the beginning, but it just works with this guy. The round armor from the TV show, and I love that blade as well. Then we have this guy. This guy is absolutely insane, awesome, insanely awesome. This helmet is just, I don't know, This they outdid themselves with that helmet. And then the nice gold. I don't really like that pattern though. And yeah. Uh, some accents there hello heroes and then we have this guy this uh the uh i forget his name the ship ship master or something like that then we've got the purple sword the purple sword makes the white armor stand stand out we have the blue here and just white wow that's hard to focus on 
Yeah. Okay. And then we have Jega Redumni. This guy is absolutely awesome. This guy is second place. This guy is like insanely awesome. I love this blade. I love the red, red black, and then this like I don't know burnt face just goes so well together. Last but not least, my favorite, and I don't think anyone <laughs> expected me not to choose this one, the Flood Elite. This thing is absolutely awesome. I love this. I'm, I'm. This is probably gonna be my favorite for a long time until they outdo this one. But this one is just absolutely phenomenal. There is my. I don't even know top number. Top number of uh, my favorite uh, elites from my collection. And yeah, uh, another Maker Constructs video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.